quarterback Patrick Mahomes has already built himself a Hall of Fame resume at just 27 years old. The Kansas City Chiefs superstar is chasing and could surpass a Hall of Famer in the AFC title game, Mahomes trails legendary Miami Dolphins quarterback Dan Marino for the most touchdowns in all time in the playoffs. Mahomes currently has 30, while Marino sits with 32. The Chiefs quarterback could tie and surpass another Hall of Famer in Kurt Warner, who has 31. In his young career, Mahomes has put up some impressive stats along with his 30 playoff touchdowns. He's thrown for 3,576 yards with a 66.7 completion percentage in 12 career playoff starts. In that category, the 2018 NFL MVP is 934 yards away from tying Marino, 4,510 yards. Mahomes trails Warner by just 376 yards. On the New Heights podcast with his Chiefs teammate Travis Kelsey and his brother Jason, Mahomes was asked to give his Mount Rushmore of quarterbacks. Mahomes named Tom Brady, Joe Montana, and Peyton Manning but was split between John Elway and Marino for the fourth slot. The Super Bowl 54 MVP ultimately chose Elway over Marino. I'm gonna give it to Elway just because he has the rings, but Marino, if you look at the stats, his first season, 48 touchdowns in that era. Dude, best quarterback season, has to be in history. I don't care what anyone says, every single time that I've been putting up and breaking these records, it's like, Dan Marino had 170 touchdowns in three years. I'm like, what? I thought they ran the ball back then. Without question, Mahomes has a great deal of respect for Dan Marino and his accomplishments. The question is will he surpass the great Dolphins quarterback in his fourth consecutive AFC title game? Mahomes will face off against Joe Burrow and the Bengals for the third time in his career and the second time in the playoffs. The Chiefs faced the Bengals in last season's AFC title game, coming up short. Patrick Mahomes threw for 275 yards, three touchdowns, and two interceptions in the heartbreaking loss. If the chief star can duplicate that success with touchdowns this time around against the Bengals, he'll pass both Marino and Warner. It remains to be seen if the two-time All-Pro adds to his legacy and surpasses Marino in the AFC title game.